three minutes to think. The Bible is the absolute authority of all truth. It is God's word. God, the all-knowing creator of everything. It contains all the information man needs for life, righteousness, and eternity. Nowhere does it mention alien life somewhere in the galaxies. There are four categories of life it does mention. Firstly, it mentions the animals, beasts of the field, birds of the air, fish of the sea, and insects of the earth. Secondly, it mentions angels, uh, seraphims, cherubs, archangels, fallen angels, otherwise known as demons, devils, principalities, powers, and forces of darkness. And some it mentions by name, Gabriel, Michael, and Lucifer. Uh, thirdly, it mentions mysterious creatures dwelling in heaven, uh, the four beasts around the throne, uh, the unknown 24 elders, and creatures full of eyes. And fourthly, it mentions humans, male and female. That's it. When man was created, he was given dominion over all of creation. And when man sinned, he sent the entire universe into a death spiral. That's what the second law of thermodynamics is. If there were sentient beings in the universe, they would be under the dominion of man and would need to be redeemed by the blood of Jesus Christ. But scripture doesn't mention any of them. Therefore, they, uh, they either don't exist or they'll play no part in humanity's history. What does exist is fallen angels. Lucifer, or Satan, and his angels, and they masquerade as beings of light. They pretend to be good helpers of mankind. Occultists, who deny the Bible, come into contact with these deceivers, and they tell them, through magic, witchcraft, ceremonies, and rituals, that they are alien beings, or ascended masters, or ghosts, or dead family members, or beings from another dimension. These aliens are nothing more than demons masquerading as good beings. These aliens all espouse antichrist ideologies. They speak of all religions being a path to God. They speak of a need for a one world government. And they all deny the deity of Jesus Christ. There are testimonies of people coming into contact with these beings and calling on the name of Jesus, at which point the beings flee. These ideologies identify these beings as demonic. And the supposed UFOs that we see are nothing more than sophisticated, advanced, and secretive government technology. They say the government is at least 50 years beyond the technology we have available to us. The Bible speaks of a great deception coming upon the earth. Demons posing as an alien life form that deny scriptural truths could certainly cause this great deception. Be aware. Be alert and put your full faith and trust in God, his son, Jesus Christ, and his word, the Holy Bible.